I want you to stay safe too, so. Oh, uh, I'm fine. <laughs> Come on, I do lemons. <laughs> I've done three and a half hours since. Yeah, we have a 26 gallon fuel cell on our. All right. Oh, so it's three and a half hours since. So we have Kevin, uh, it's Joe? Correct. Cool, you're with Nico. We're in the Cayman S, 15 laps. Eight laps, either cool down or we'll pull in, then we'll do the seven, and then at the end we'll do also a cool down lap. Okay. I know it's chilly outside, but yeah. the car still can get hot. So, quick things before we get started. The mirrors are for this guy. So in the event that you have to care about who's behind you, because I'm watching that, I'll let you know. I'll say, hey, stay to the right, stay to the left. Okay. We'll hug that side of the track. I'll grab the wheel. I'll turn on the flashers. They're going to go around us. I'll let go. Turn off the flashers, and then we'll chase them. Yeah? Got it. Yeah, we're going to pass. Wait for my okay. Okay. After I say okay, then we'll go around. I'll help guide. Don't worry about me. I'm just helping. And once we get around, I'll let go, and then they're gone forever. Because if you can catch them, you probably lose them, right? Okay. So, cones, you know what they do. Yeah. Two orange cones, straight line braking, nice and firm, nice and smooth. First green cone, start turning, easing off that brake, nice and slow. Trail braking, last 10% of your braking is done all the way to the apex. Second green cone. When you're there, all the way close. That, at that moment, as you're transitioning from brake to the throttle, look for the third green cone, unwind the wheel, and squeeze the throttle, right? When the car is straight and the track's straight, your foot's better be hurry. Right? So, remember smooth is fast and look where you want to go. Otherwise, ready to get rolling? I'm ready to get rolling. Cool. So we'll leave it auto like we discussed. Okay. And if you change your mind, let me know because I, I have no problem with it. <laughs> so here's your Porsche. Press down on the top, pull it all the way back, and then we'll get rolling. So we're going to go to the left side of the Huracan. Good looking car. Good looking car. And sounds great too. Yeah. Have to say. And then we're going to go right. Then we'll turn left, waiting, looking for anyone crazy enough. We'll stop right here just for a second so I can check the track. We're going to actually wait. I know, it's a lot. You're that already is here, fine. You're right here. It's like, ah, <laughs> oh, we can't get on the track just yet. Great. So I'm going to wait until the R8 goes by. Okay. Once the R8 goes by, we're going to cruise on out. So I'm going to chase my like stepdaughter. Myself. Yeah, it gives you a goal. Perfect. And it keeps us from going too fast too quickly. She's flying. Well, let's get going. Stay to the right. We're normally, we're turning, easing off the brakes now to that apex. Then we're squeezing the throttle, staying to the left, because we're setting up for the next turn. Turn the other way. Second apex. And squeeze the throttle the rest of the way, all the way out. That is increasing radius, so don't be afraid to use all that space. Nice and wide. Now come back in. 
That's second apex and all the way out to the right. All the way out, there we go. So they're gonna let us pass somewhere around here. So start turning, clip that apex, stay to the left. Start squeezing the throttle. Turn the other way, second apex. All the way out to the left, squeeze the throttle the rest of the way. Perfect. Exactly. That's what you feel 
like, that is great. What a car. enough on the brake? Yes. You're perfect on your braking. I'm just going to start pushing you to exactly the cones. Time the brakes turn apex. I did you know if you needed more. Straighten up and brake. Good. Apex. Track right, look left. Second apex. Get in there. Come all the way out to the right. They're in front of me. They're in front of you, right? So you want to break at the cones, right? Okay. Wait for the cones. Wait for it to disappear. Once they vanish, that's the moment to start hitting the brakes. Got it. Keep it all the way down until you have to do that braking. It'll force you to break even deeper, and that perfect braking will force you to trail braking in the corner. Because sometimes I notice we lit up, and if we lit up before that eight, that first apex. Stay to the left side. We're going to let yeah. someone by. Don't let go, please. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's turn. So, okay. yeah. So, don't worry about get back on the throttle. We can get up, back up the pace. Track right. Look left. Second apex. We're going to get back up the pace. Yeah, just remember, if you can still see him, you're not at him, right? All the way out. Stay 
tight. Now start squeezing that throttle. Get on it. All the way. There we go. That's the downshift. Oh, wow. 
that. Was, okay. So you know what it is. When the light bulb goes on, right? my mistakes just beautifully. <laughs> it does. The thing is, it didn't do a whole lot. Another die. I didn't touch the brakes. I didn't do anything for you. The car didn't do a whole lot for you. I can tell. And the only thing is, though, we kept, we scared ourselves at the end. I felt it. And when we started turning, especially for something like this, we're going, holy crap, I'm carrying too much speed. Brake more. Don't. Oh, no. Yeah, I have to remember that lesson. We started to get on that. We started to turn. And then we kind of froze and broke a little more because we are carrying so much speed. Instead of breaking a little more, just turn that wheel. Turn the wheel. And just trust the car. If I, if I said, oh no, it won't do it, brake more, then we'll do it. If I say, keep going, do it, it'll do it. Trust me, I've had way too many laps in this car. <laughs> <laughs> and it's, it'll handle it. And that's the best part about this car is that it will handle it. So yeah. don't be afraid when, when you, you're driving so well that you're scaring yourself. That's where you know that you're doing well. <laughs> I did a couple of times. <laughs> so that's when you need to start going, is it me or, or is it the car? <laughs> so then you know it's you. And you're like, all right, so we're going to exit to the right in the okay. boom. So you did really, 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 really well. And your improvements were so significant. Wow, thanks. Well, I got your, good instruction. Well, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> your, your, your improvements were so significant that when you... When you got to that point where you're nearing 100, percent it started to make you want to back off. Yep, it, was, it did. Yeah. It was exactly. We'll put it right back where we got it. It was exactly where you need to be, though. So you're. That, that was a good amount of laps, though. We had a lot of time to work. Yeah, we had a lot of time to practice. <laughs> we had good practice. That but, was great. But always push the envelope, and at that level. You're in the 90s, upper 90s, for a percentage of what a car can do, right? So, if you keep going, well, this is all God, this is all God, I should stop here, I should stop here, I should let ease off, you'll stay at 95, 98, 99. So you, you hit 101 once, and you go, whoa! And then that's where you know that that's 101%. Right. And then you know where 100% is because you're at 99. So then you can find that perfect balance. And that's where we're at is that a fine, fine, fine line of too much and too little, too little is now becoming very, very clear, and it's becoming more of an exact spot than it is, oh, there's 90 and there's 100, it's somewhere there. We're getting very, very, very close to that perfect spot. Absolutely. And that's the best part, and how, if you get one, <laughs> you can continue working on that, which is the best part. The, uh, I, I felt when the back end started to go out on me, I, I felt like I was pretty close to that. Yeah, and you'll get there. And trust yeah. me, 